Power switches are an important part to any DIY electric skateboard build. The added convenience of not having to plug and unplug your ESC is essential to any solid DIY experience. The obvious reason for a power switch is to power your board on and off, but there is a bit more to it than just that. Anti-spark switches do exactly as the name would suggest. It acts as a switch and prevents sparks from occurring when power is connected to your ESC. Sparks aren't necessarily harmful to your ESC, but they can be harmful over a long period of time or with some bad luck. So when should you use an anti-spark power switch? Well, you should use one anytime your ESC doesn't have a built-in power button. Basic ESCs like these have their own onboard power buttons, but VESCs do not. The power buttons are actually very easy to use. Simply add the power switch in between your battery and your ESC, add the power button to your enclosure, and that's all there is to it. The only downside to these types of switches is the cost. If you do a quick search for power buttons or switches, you'll come across two different types. One type is great for low voltage, high amperage applications, and the other is rated for high voltage and low amperage applications. But these anti-spark switches are rated for high voltage and high amperage projects, so the price isn't as low as some of these other general switches online, but compared to the cost of a replacement ESC in the event that a spark does damage your ESC, it really isn't too bad after all. At the end of the day, an anti-spark power switch is a great way to add function and protection to your DIY electric skateboard build. If you guys have any questions, please leave a comment down below, and if you're interested in getting a power switch for yourself, I have left a link in the description for your convenience. Please be sure to subscribe as there's a ton of new electric skateboard content coming to this channel every week.